Happy third day of Women's History Month. Our book star today is Shadowfall by Ceresia Glass. And our heroine is Kira Solomon. Kira kicks ass. Kira knows Egyptian history. She's saving the world from demons. In other words, if you want some adventure in your life and you want to read about Egyptians that look like Egyptians are supposed to look, like they black, y'all. And we not talking about this Hollywood stuff. You need to go ahead and pick up Ceresia Glass's books. There are... There's Shadow Blade, Shadow Chase, Shadow Fall. We need to go ahead and read these books, write to Hollywood, and tell them this is what they need to be putting on the big screen. We want to see adventure where women of color are out there kicking butt, taking names, smart, sexy, and all of that. And they can't say the material's not there because bam, here it is. And it's a series. Let's put it on TV. Put it on stars. Hello, Shonda Land. Are you listening? You need to hit up Ceresia Glass so that we can get some urban fantasy in this world that's not just the werewolves and the vampires and the white girls with the blonde hair. I mean, no offense to anybody that reads that because I'm not going to sit up here and act like I didn't like the uh, Suki Stackhouse books. True blood, not so much, but moving on. Um... There are more ways to tell a story than people pretend they are. There are thousands of ways to tell a story, and there are millions of ways to put people of color in these stories. Ceresia Glass laid you the blueprint. Now, pick up her book, read it, love it, call her people, pay her, put this on the big screen. Because Kara Solomon... Hello. What's sexier than a chick with knives and, and riding motorcycles and, and saving the world from demons. And not only that, she looks like us. Come on, let's get let's get right. Book of the day. Shadow Falls, Ceresia Glass. And our star heroine, Kira Solomon. Let's do this. <laughs>